Bryce Harper watch continues, and Jesse Sanchez of MLB.com was first to report that the Dodgers are back in the mix for Harper. Club officials, including manager Dave Roberts, were seen in Harper's hometown of Las Vegas Sunday. I'm Heidi Watney with this MLB.com FastCast. Dodgers manager Dave Roberts confirmed reports Monday that he and other club officials met with free agent Bryce Harper in Las Vegas Sunday night, but offered little details on the meeting or likelihood of a deal with the outfielder. It was good. It was good. Just kind of trying to uh, you know, get to know each other. And uh, I, I, uh, I think in the spirit of us as a Dodgers, you know, vetting a certain process makes sense. And... Um, for those guys to do their due diligence as well. Prior to the Yankees' first exhibition of the spring, manager Aaron Boone said Aaron Hicks does not receive the credit that he deserves, adding that the 29-year-old may be the most underrated player in the game. Well, Hicks and the Yankees completed a seven-year, $70 million contract extension with a club option for the 2026 season on Monday. The deal replaces Hicks' one-year, $6 million contract for 2019 that was previously announced on January 11th. Hicks spoke to the media on Monday. The reason why I signed uh, this deal was that, like I said, I thought it was a fair deal for both sides. And I want to be here. Uh, the guys in the clubhouse, I want to fight for them. Um, I want to go to war with them, and uh, which is the main reason why I signed to go here. After leading the Rockies to the postseason in his first two seasons, manager Bud Black and the club agreed to a three-year contract extension through 2022 on Monday. Black was entering the final year of his original three-year contract, which called for a mutual option for 2020. Under Black, the Rockies earned two postseason berths as the National League wildcard winner. Black spoke Monday on the direction of the team. I feel that, uh, you know, where we are as a team, um, where we can get to ultimately is what this is all about. And I, you know, again, grateful for the trust that Jeff places in me to do this job. Uh, but you know, he's mentioned it multiple times now. This is a, this is collaborative. This is something that we all do, from you know, from the top, you know, all the way down to you know, everybody in baseball operations and even in the, even the entire organization. This is uh, an organization that I, you know, that I stress in inclusiveness, uh, working together, because uh, that's what it takes. For more on these stories and complete spring training coverage, keep it locked to MLB.com. It's baseball everywhere.